Hi, I'm Ted Cruz. There's nothing more important to Texas than strong families. And excellent education is critical to the future of Texas. Thank you for all that you do to support Texas teachers, students, and families to make it easier for everyone to be able to achieve the American dream. As your senator, I'm blessed to represent 28 million Texans. And I've worked every day with the conviction that all children deserve an excellent education that gives them the opportunity to succeed. The role of the federal government should be to return more dollars and more decisions to local school boards and the communities they serve. For years, America's education system has put too much power and decision-making authority in Washington in the hands of unelected bureaucrats and taking decisions out of the hands of the teachers and the parents with the most knowledge and care for their own children. Similarly, one-size-fits-all curricula like Common Core aren't the right answer because education decisions should be made on the state level and even better the local level where parents and communities can be directly involved and can be, find the best solutions suited to their kids' needs. I believe school choice is the civil rights issue of the 21st century. Every single child in Texas deserves access to an excellent education, regardless of race, ethnicity, wealth, or zip code. That's why I support school choice in all its forms, whether charter schools or scholarships or education savings accounts. Indeed, one of the legislative accomplishments I'm most proud of is authoring and passing the most significant federal school choice legislation that has ever passed Congress. As part of the tax cut that we passed in December, I introduced an amendment to expand College 529 savings plans, which allow parents and grandparents to save in a tax advantage way for college expenses. They're immensely popular. 18 million Americans use them now. My amendment which passed 50-50 on the Senate floor, with the vice president casting the tie-breaking vote, expands 529 savings plans to include K-12 through education. Now, parents and grandparents can save up to $10,000 per year per child for public school, private school, parochial school, or religious school, your choice. And by increasing competition, by increasing the options to parents and students, we're increasing the quality of public schools all across Texas. The safety of our children when they go to school is a vital priority for every parent, Heidi and me included. That's why I fought hard to pass legislation increasing school safety. In 2013, I introduced legislation that would have spent $300 million making our schools safer. My legislation received 52 votes on the Senate floor, a majority including nine Democrats, the most bipartisan support of any of the comprehensive legislation introduced. But sadly, Harry Reid and the Democrats filibustered the bill, demanding 60 votes to pass. Just two weeks ago, I introduced a school safety amendment that would have once again allocated millions more to school safety. And once again, sadly, Senate Democrats blocked its passage. The most effective tools for keeping schools safe, which I've heard directly from parents and teachers and students at Santa Fe High School and all across the state, are more armed police officers on campus, are metal detectors in schools as determined by local districts, allowing teachers who are trained, who are competent, to keep and bear arms if they wish, shrinking the numbers, the number of entrances to schools, just like we've done at banks and courthouses and other government buildings, and hardening the infrastructure with things like bulletproof doors to keep kids safer. My legislation would have funded all of these, and I will continue fighting for each of these common sense measures to keep our kids safe.